Hey everyone, we are Teresa and Nicole. We are the bestest of friends. I love Nicole so very much. And we are doing a mystery unboxing. So we got three of the Jeffree Star Valentine's Day mystery boxes, two premiums, and one of the deluxe. We wanted two of the deluxe, but they sold out really quickly. So we decided to get two of these so we could at least have our own. But you get what you get, you can't get upset. The small premium was $40 and the deluxe box was $75. I don't want people to have crazy stuff about shipping, but there's a lot of controversy people were talking about. So we're not going to talk about that today because a lot of other people made videos about it. So let's keep it happy. Okay, so we're each going to open our premium boxes right now. So let's see what we got. So as we know, the Jeffree Star boxes all come with this cute little pink Tissue paper. tissue paper. Looks like this on the inside. Ooh, see a lot of pink Jeffree Star's signature color. The first thing that you see is the pop socket. All the boxes come with pop sockets, premium, deluxe, all of them. It's a little red pop socket with his logo on it. I also got a red one, as you can see there. Put that to the side. So we'll start with the highlighter that comes in the box. Uh, I got the King Tut highlighter. Oh, I'll open that. A bunch of different that shades. That looks like it's like a gold coppery color. And in mine, I got the mint condition. Let's go ahead and see what. Well, I think we all know what <laughs> the mint condition one looks like. So with my nails, let me go ahead and. Skin Frost, same packaging as all the other ones. Let's open that one up and wow. It matches your nails. <laughs> it matches my nails. Super green, super frothy looking, creamy. All right, let's put then that Then you got three, the Velour Liquid Lipsticks and one lip ammunition in each of the boxes for the $40 one. So we'll start with the lipstick. I got the X Supermodel lip ammunition. Looks like a bullet. Nice and shiny, pretty packaging. I have not gotten one of I these have yet. None of these. So. so these are super cute bullet little forms. Mine's in Popsicle Dream. Looks purple. The X Supermodel is this light, kind of mauvey pink color. Wow, my swatching hand thing is so bad. <laughs> Look at my swatch! Look at my swatch! And I got a popsicle dream color. And that is a purple. So she got more of like a funky color, and I feel like this is more of a wearable for kind of everybody. And as we all know, Jeffree Star loves to create these elaborate colors. He likes to go out of the box. He wants to wow everyone and... I'm not a hater on that. I like trying different things. I could go neutral one day, super dark the next, and then a pop of color, because why the fuck not? So then we got the three Velour liquid lipsticks. I have it in Posh Spice, Clout, and Scandal. And my three premium box Velour liquid lipsticks are in Diva, Jeffrey, Who, and Scandal. So super cute colors, super fun, funky, and fresh. So two of them are from, I believe, the Alien Collection, and they come in this white packaging with the glitter all over them. You can see it shines really nice all over the whole thing, on the bottle, on the lid. And then the regular collection one with the pink top. So Posh Spice is just kind of this cool toned, you know, kind of a neutral brown. Cloud is kind of this like metallic lavender color. And then... Scandal is kind of like a pinky mauve again, but a little bit darker than the X Supermodel one. And mine, we're going to start with Diva here, and that is a bright pink. Wow. Oh, look at how that came out. Pink. See it right there? Super cute. Looks summery. I don't know why it's like that in the packaging. You see that? It's okay. 
that's go just, ahead and that's why you have shake, shake that up a little bit. And we have Jeffrey Hu, which, as you can see through the packaging, it's sparkly, so it looks a little lighter than from the box itself. But when you open it up, oh wow. Yeah, it is kind of lighter than the packaging, but it's this pretty, almost red color here. Like if you a can deep see. pink. Deep pink. And last but not least, oh, I also got a scandal. We got two scandals here. And again, that is a nice mauvey pink. Mauve pink color. I'm Easy. pretty happy. I think that they're a nice mix of wearable colors and. I yeah. definitely see getting use out of all of them. You got a, a little bit of a pop of color or a little bit of metallic, and then you got some nice neutrals that you can kind of wear like every day. So now we're both going to open this one. Um, it's a Lux Valentine's Day box. So let's see what we got. All right. So same thing. We got the tissue paper, the pink, and we'll just open that up a little bit. You can see you got some different items in there. So, as per usual with the other boxes, we got the uh, Jeffree Star Pop Socket. Same one as the one in the premium boxes. Look at the skin frost we have today. That is in Regina George. You want to go ahead oh, and open pink. this up? Crazy one. I have not seen this in person yet. So, I'm I know that it's very, very pink. Very pink. A lot of people say you can use it as like a blush. Or I a mean, blush topper just to give your... Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go and show the camera. That is pink. pink. It almost like blends in with the packaging how pink that is. On Wednesdays, we, we wear, wear pink. pink. <laughs> so... <I don't. laughs> So then we have a skin frost, um, sorry, a supreme frost Ooh. in the color frozen peach. And the packaging on this one's a little bit different. It's a little smaller. It has the open top and then you, it's like a more metallic pink. And if you open it up, it has the Jeffree Star Ooh. Cosmetics that says across the top here. It kind of reminds me of those sunglasses where you pop the top up. It really does. And then it's kind of like a light, almost like champagne gold color. That is super pretty. Very, very sparkly. This one I think is very wearable for everyone, and this I believe that every single deluxe box got this shade in it. Let's go to the lipsticks now. So there is one lip ammunition, three velour liquid lipsticks, and one uh, the lip liner, velour lip liners. So we'll start with the lipstick and the lip liner. So the lipstick is in the shade Gargoyle. Which I'm actually really intrigued by because it's different. You know, I haven't seen a color like this really that often. So Yeah, that's going to be super fun to see what that comes out like. Now this box looks like it's a little hard to open. So, so this uh, lip ammunition, I guess, was from a special collection because it's shiny as compared to the one that I previously opened, which uh, was just the pink packaging. So there's that and the color is this dark cool tone gray color. Now, with Jeffree Star's new Velour Liquid Lip Liners, we got the shade Calabasas. And Which I, is part, one of the more popular ones, I believe, that he talks about a lot. Now, this- I haven't seen this in person with this top. This packaging is super pretty. Super extra. It really is <laughs> extra. I feel like this shade can go with like a lot of colors this though. Is what the top looks like. Wow. Super shiny. I know people say it looks like a crown, but I don't really know what that's supposed to look like, to be honest. But I like it. That's all that matters, right? It looks like a wand. Now, this is the top. It looks so. kind of like a neutral color, like a light mauvey brown. Yeah, and it kind I of call everything mauvey brown or whatever. Yeah, it looks mauve. Pink packaging. Wanna do a little swatchy swatchy? We'll go ahead on this part of my hand here yeah, so I can bit, turn yeah. it. It's like a kind of dark mauvey pink. It is a little weird when you apply it, but I guess I think that might be because of your it's on my hands. Wrist. But this is the swatch. Can you go ahead and see it right there? 
Not bad though. I think you could go with a lot of pinks, a lot of maybe reds even if you wanted to do kind of like an ombre look. And that's Calabasas. Okay. So now we have the three Velour Liquid Lipsticks. We have Doll Parts, Crocodile Tears, and Self Control. Okay, so we're going to open those for you. I believe this one is from what, another one of their collections, but I'm not too sure which one. So open Crocodile's Tears first, and it's this green, almost kind of like an evergreen kind of green, like a Christmas tree. Um, I'm kind of in love with it. I'm kind of in love with crocodiles and reptiles, so I'm really excited about the name of this. It is from their regular packaging. I knew, I believe it came out in one of their first holiday collections. I don't know if they made it permanent because it's in the pink now, but I like this a lot. <laughs> And in this Velour Liquid Lip, we got Self Control, and this looks like a mauve purple color, but I can dig it because... A light lavender, lilac kind of color. Lavender is my This has the color. red packaging. Red packaging. From one of their collections. Shiny red chrome with the stars. I don't know if you can see it. The stars going all the way around. And it is this nice purple mauve color and it doesn't smell like anything but not what a lot color of is mauve? mauve i would say mauve. <laughs> i don't know anymore i, I, would, I hear it's purple mauve pink mauve i'm not too sure anymore I, everything's mauve everything mauve's great mauve. color love mauve <laughs> all right and our last one is from a regular collection and it is it's all parts, and I believe this is a more muted pink tone color. That's super pretty. Interesting. And the final item, we have the Can't Relate t-shirt. We were able to get a size small. Originally, we wanted to get two for each, but we got one, so we'll just rotate them. <laughs> And, oh wow, this is super soft material. Very soft. Look at that. I like the color too. The color is I think nice. it's very 2018. I feel like 2018 was the year of red tones. And I'm definitely feeling that. And as you can see here, it's pink. We got some hearts. Looks like we got some Jeffree Star hands saying, can't relate. Light. Oh, and it also got some little hearts, so maybe this will be cutesy for, like, Valentine's Day. Oh, it also has the Jeffree Star logo in pink on the back. But super soft material. This is really, really cute. We'll go ahead and put this to the side see what we can do with that. So, what did you think about these boxes? Are you happy? How are you feeling? I'm actually surprised. I really thought that we were going to get, like, more of, like, the same colors as like, just like the highlighters maybe. I was surprised about the option, to be quite honest. I could wear every single one I of these. I think there was a nice mix of, you know, more wearable tones, like the pinks or the light pinks, and then you have some like real pops of color, right. like uh, Diva, which is more like in your face, or, you know, Gargoyle, or the Crocodile Tears. So I like that there's a nice range. I like that you get, you know, in the deluxe box, you got a crazy highlighter like Regina George. You also got a nice little wearable skin frost. Yeah, I mean, Regina George is a bright color, but I feel like people use it as blushes. You can use it as eyeshadow. You can... And the pan is ginormous. It good. It's, it's ginormous. Huge. I've never seen, like, anything. Like, it's heavy. It's weighted. You know, the pans are, like, they feel good in your hand. They have a nice, good hand feel. They got the huge mirror. I could um, put my whole face in this yeah. mirror, really. And it's super, they're super Bright. They're just ginormous. Like, I don't know when you're ever going to run out of this. Yeah, it's going to take a while to hit pan on this, for real. I like it, though. I'm very, I'm satisfied. Of course, it is a mystery, so you never know what you're going to get. And I feel like a lot of these are, some of them are, like, popular. I'm pretty happy. Um, we also don't really own a lot of Jeffree Star products. No. Uh, we did get some for Christmas. Just, like, you know, a little dabbling of everything. We got the blood sugar palette. We got one of the Velour Liquid Lipsticks. We got a lip scrub and a highlighter. Mm -hmm. But we don't really have a lot. So mm -hmm. this is a nice way to get uh, a decent amount. Add to the collection. To try things to see, oh, do I like this? Do I like that? Add to your collection. You know, try different things. And it's a good price, too, because... 
you know, the premium box is $40, but the Skin Frost by itself is $29. So you get this and one of the lipsticks and you're already over your what you paid for it. So it's totally worth it in terms of if you really don't have a lot of the collection or anything from the line, it's a good way to get like dabble into it and see, you know, do I like this? And it's for a good price too. Yeah, I mean, when you're on the website, you're just like, what colors would I wear? What kinds of combination of things should I get? What lip liner, what this, what that? This gives you an option to really look at each color, each pigment, and see what you're into, what you really like, and get out of the box a little yeah, bit. Yeah, you might it. get to try colors maybe that you wouldn't have picked up normally, but now you have it, so you can try it. Um, so like crocodile tears, I'm super excited about this. Also, they're all eye safe. So even if you, maybe it's not your favorite color to wear on your lips, you can wear just an eyeliner. Yeah, it's super eye safe and you could just think of different things to use these things with. Did some research to see, you know, if the boxes were gonna be different, if all of the like premium boxes were gonna have the same stuff, all the deluxe boxes were gonna have the same stuff. And based on my research, it looks like there were four options for you to get in the premium box and two options to get into the deluxe box. So the four options were based on which highlighter you got. So if you got the King Tut, you were gonna get the lipsticks that I showed here, that we got. If you were gonna get the uh, mint condition one, you were gonna get those same lipsticks in that box. Then there were two other highlighter options for the premium box. You could have got uh, Regina George, so the pop pink one. And in that one, you would have got the Lip Ammunition in Jeffrey's Girl. And you would have got three of the Velour Liquid Lipsticks in Can't Relate, Watermelon Soda, and Clout. And then you could also have gotten the Deep Freeze of having Deep Freeze, which is like a aqua, aqua blue, frosty I would say. kind of blue. And in that one, you would have got the Lip Ammunition in Starfish, um, three Velour Liquid Lipsticks in Can't Relate, Triggered, and Watermelon Soda. So then the other, now for the deluxe boxes, it looked like there were two options. So you either got Lavender Snow Highlighter or you got the Regina George Highlighter. If you got the Lavender Snow Highlighter, you, every single deluxe box got the uh, pre, uh, Frozen Peach Supreme Frost and the Can't Relate t-shirt. Yes, all of them got the Can't Relate t-shirt. And all the boxes got the Jeffree Star Pop Sockets. And so the lip, lip ammunition you would have got was Jeffree's Girl for the Lavender Snow Box, a Posh Spice liquid lip, uh, Velour Liquid Lipstick, Dream House Velour Liquid Lipstick, Diamond Velour Liquid Lipstick, and then it seemed like you could get either one of the uh, Velour Lip Liners, either Unicorn Blood or Posh Spice. Now, for our box that we got, we got the Regina George one, and you would have gotten the ones that we showed you, the Gargoyle, uh, Crocodile Tears, Doll Parts, And, and self-control. And self-control. And for the uh, velour lip liner, you were either going to get Dominatrix or Calabasas. That's what it seemed like all the options were. Now, I know a lot of people still haven't gotten their boxes yet or waiting for there to get shipping confirmations. So maybe we'll see some other options you can get. But so far, those are the ones that I have seen. I think that they're pretty good boxes, like I said, for people who maybe don't have the collection. Now, I know a lot of people said stuff about you know, getting the same kind of ones in the previous mystery boxes from Black Friday. I do think it's a little weird that they use the same highlighters, like the Men Condition and the Regina George. They have a pretty decent range, so I feel like maybe they could have used something else. I don't mind the Deep Freeze being in there, and I don't mind the Lavender Snow being in there. I don't mind that I got the Men Condition and, or, and the Regina George that we got those, because right. we don't have any. But if you bought those boxes, now you have another one. Yeah, you have another one, and I feel like it's just kind of, it is supposed to be a mystery, but it also just feels like since we have seen them in the previous boxes from just watching YouTube, watching everyone's reviews and stuff like that, we see that maybe it's product that hasn't really sold on the website as much as some of the more popular highlighters. Yeah, I don't even know if I remember seeing Min Condition on the website when I looked. I know Deep Freeze is on there and Lavender Snow. I'm not too sure if Regina George and the uh, Min Condition are still on there. Um, I'm pretty happy though. I'm happy too. I I'm think excited. Experimenting with all these different colors, all these different highlighters and lip ammunitions will be super fun. And we could try this new 
little trinket out. I keep saying trinket because this is a super unusual top, but we'll just have to see how that goes on our lips. 